All right, so I'm just about to paint the inside of my trailer. Got everything all taped up. The vents all taped up. So it's going to be from the top of the wall to the bottom. I'm not putting anything on the bottom of the floor. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to go all the way to the floor or not. Probably good. Um, and it's the door. Got the light taped up. Ceiling. Oh, I didn't take that up. My uh, trailer. Spare tire. Uh, yeah, my. I don't care if they get paint on it, but yeah. I'm just gonna do a before and after. I'm not gonna do a video of the whole process. It's a little bit more light there. Yeah, I'm not gonna do all that. So, we'll be back. All right, so we got the trailer all painted. Just the side. Uh, walls I did I'm gonna put the mat back on it's not cut the it is cut to fit but I gotta perfect it cut it just a little bit more cut the d-rings out that's what's not cut out you gotta cut the Moto D transport kit yeah cut that out too and then I got another stand up there I had to cut out. Yeah, but it actually is a little bit brighter in here with the color I chose. Yeah, I apologize about the color. The, this might not be the brightest, but uh, this is a Pittsburgh paint. It's kaleidoscope is the color. A little swatch here. It's a middle one so it's a uh, acrylic latex and a uh, semi gloss I went with, th with that because it is a hundred percent rejects mildew so it stands up to mildew pretty good so just wanted something a little bit lighter I didn't want white uh, and I got chose I was gonna do a latex flat but semi-gloss is a little bit easier to clean off so this is a pretty durable paint uh that i that i chose so uh we'll take a look at it in the morning when it's more light let's see, see how it actually turned out all right so this is the paint that has dried in the trailer Actually, if you stand back here, the ceiling kind of looks the same color, but it's actually not. It's, this is uh, aluminum. So, yeah, just a reflection off of it. But it looks good. Looks pretty good. It's around the light, it's around the door. So I just got to finish trimming the carpet, get everything in here even and square, and uh, we'll come back then. But for now, yeah, the walls look nice, very nice, turned out very nice. Better than that wood that's not just on there. <laughs> 